Right, Julie Phelps. Ahem. We have the basis Christmas mug. I see it's a used basis Christmas mug. <laughs> Just to say it's used. Is that what I get? A used Christmas. That's the one you get. <laughs> uh, oh, God, get it in the right place. Uh, there it is. Only available at the basis 2022 seminars. Can't get it anywhere else. You can't even order online or mail order or say, could you send me a Christmas mug? No. Only people who go to the conference on Saturday the 17th get this mug. And uh, when finish, when Christmas is over, you can do this and have it after Christmas. Right? That's Claire Claire's design based on a design that I had made and then she modified it. And then she put the detail in the eyes. Oh, that makes all the difference. It does. Scary. <coughs> right. Uh, I've just been speaking to guys from Sky. Uh, I used to be with all those years ago. And there's a whole pile of things happening in football. But we leave that for another show. Okay, we've got Simon Miles talking about the uh, René Le Chateau and the alignments of the mo on the a whole pile of critical alignments there with the stars and everything else. Very important work. Not about some priest who found some money in a old building. Then we got Peter Paget, who's former science advisor to the government when he was seventeen years old, publisher of the writer and publisher of the Welsh Triangle, and he's going to talk about the Black Triangle. Uh, that's about whales and a lot of UFO stuff there. And yeah, you might have I'm something to say about that. I'm in the centre of that bit, the Welsh Triangle. In yeah. fact, I've got his books. I've got two of his books. My so, God. Yeah, I know. And uh, artwork by uh, Lloyd Canning on the, one of the books. Mm. Then we got the wonderful Elaine, uh, Elaine, uh, uh, Elena, something or other. Gosh, she's, uh, I forgot. Oh, God. Elaine. And she is going to, she's actually local. And she's actually got some connections with Elena Denan, but also um, the uh, a guy, the, the last speaker of the day is, um, oh God, I fucking ready. The last speaker of the day is Alexandra Quinn. So he's going to send us off on a merry thing and a happier sort of frame of mind. And we've got Claire uh, herself, and she'll sort of, I think, open the day with bases actual. And some of the material that she's gone through, actually, are the same drawings. And she's seen very similar things as to what Elena Denan has published in her book. Right, yeah. But... Which I have seen some of the aliens that Elena Denan has put in the book. Uh, I recognise them and cross-reference them. I haven't got them with me right this second, but exactly the same, or, you know, the slightly yeah. different tunic, but exactly the same reptilian, um, which was, as she put, not a friendly one, and I would totally agree. <laughs> well, that that's a big deal. It's uh, a lot of these pictures that, uh, I mean, there's a, I've gone through some pictures of a very, very close friend of mine called Alice Slight. I first met her uh, way back to about 1997 at the Bar Gin uh, in Honey Street. And there's an American there. And she, uh, she'll call Karen. And she had drawn some very intricate ETs in her reference book that she'd made. And I was able to take some flash photographs. It was in her tent at the barge and it was at night. So it was basically flat, you know, take what you got, but it was taken with flash. And unfortunately, everything on the left-hand page reflected because it was all, all these wonderful drawings were in her, uh, in those plastic sleeves. And I don't know where Karen is, but uh, we lost contact. You were talking 20, 25 years ago, 1997. Long, long time ago. And that's when I first met Alice. And it was while going through that. And Alice was actually for, was a former girlfriend of John Lear. Mm. Way back in the days when he was learning how to fly. And Alice also uh, uh, was very keen on the, the, the learning remote viewing. And she also um, contributed to the C SETI thing that Dr. Stephen Greer was doing that. And that was way back in the year 2000. But of course, things 
have changed since then. But somebody else called Julie Phelps is at the conference and she's going to be milling about sort of uh, helping to sell my mugs, but you may be doing something else. So Julie Phelps. Yes, Over I am going to do a presentation. And um, the thing is, um, I've been getting 